Sign up on America's Card Room today using bonus code BOSKI. 100% deposit bonus on your first deposit, up to $1,000 that will be released over time. And of course, you're eligible for the 20 days of free cash, up to $50. And shoot them an email and you might even get 27% rake back. I'll see you guys on the tables. I play under the Boski. Good luck. Oh, we're streaming. <laughs> Welcome to the Jeff Boski live stream. We're at the final table of the $55 20K. We got the table tilted. We're being very aggressive. We're making good reads. Let's get some YouTube tunes. Let's kick it back to 2000 hip hop era. Let's go with a little Young Jeezy. I am doesn't like that I'm playing slow, so guess what? I'm gonna play even slower. Thanks for letting me know what tilts you. Oh, he mad. What the hell just happened there? Uh, well, we got threes blind versus blind, and uh, just over 30 blinds. Good call, but I think this plays better as a jam. Since we're pretty much tied for last, we're all in. We got a pair. Let's get it. You don't want to give those chips back, uh-uh. All right, Holonix uh, opening almost any two here. Uh, we have just over 30 blinds. This may seem like a very big show, but four-handed, it should be profitable. We have relevant blockers, and we're playing to win. Big show, we're showing them the boss, Rollin. King Queen. Do it for my hood. Here we go, we're going in. We got the ace blocker, we're suited. Got him. Give me those chips. Cold four bet, they call it a punt? Only when it doesn't work, it's a punt. Get it right. All right, six five on the button. We're gonna stay with the plan to continue to Tilt, uh, Isra Israeli Haim, Haim, Haim 8 8. Bear with me. Should be a long term profitable strategy and allows us to balance our tough decisions with the easy ones. Life is all about balance. Halonic are both regs and we got pocket tens. Perfect timing. Could we put in another cold four ball? Uh, yeah, we're just going to rip this. He's probably got a hand like a small pair or queen jack suited. Yeah, he doesn't want to get three bet. Halonic's been very, very aggressive, so we're all in. Pocket tens to premium, four handed. And we take it down. Wow. Wow, hits the ace and holds for now three handed. Woo! Wow, snapped. No respect for the 30 blind jam with queens. That is incredible. We're going to open the ace nine on the button. Very aggressive dynamic. For him to do the 4x from the small blind is nothing new. He knows he has the chip lead. And uh, I know this looks a little thin, but three-handed, he's built up the reputation that he's going to get this action, and I'm going to shove it in his face and hopefully pick up 900,000 uncontested. We're all in with ace nine for 40 blinds. Let's get it. Got it. 
Oh, we got, you gotta read the chat for reads. The Boski, you became my hatest player of all times. Well, his English isn't very good, or he just doesn't know how to speak words. Uh, but that's a compliment. Why the hell you play slow? He's telling me what tilts it. This is what we call a read. You gotta go with the read, and we're gonna continue to play slow to tilt him. So we can get heads up with Halonic and take this baby down. Halonic is just gonna go for a lot of leverage spots like this, and he calls! Let's go, Halonic! King! Oh, alright. Uh, well, we, we like to see that violence because that, that means he's a short stack now instead of us. That's good, that's good. Uh, with 10 8 suited, I think I'm going to fold. Although it's okay to raise call Halonic. I don't want to have to face a 3-bet in battle versus Haim. Uh, kind of scared thinking, but you got to think ahead sometimes. And what they're likely to be doing to leverage their stacks versus me with the big payout jumps. Let's get a call from Haim. Aces! Slow roll them a bit! And he holds! We're heads up, guys. Huge dis chip disadvantage, which is great because we're expected to lose. We got nothing to lose. We now have $4,654.12 locked up. We're playing heads up for $1,700. Uh, he just said it's 8.20 a.m. Can you play a bit faster, bro? Why would I want to comply to his demands when we're playing for $1,700? You know how many Aquapanas I can buy for $1,700? Uh, we could jam Jack-10, but I think it has better post block playability than though we're out of position. He doesn't have 100% raising ratio, he's limp some, and he has uh, folded some. So he's going to put in the call. And we flop middle pair. It's pretty good. Pretty good. So we're just going to check call. under half pot he couldn't beat middle pair so we should be good here uh, a little bit too much to jam uh, hopefully it's just a brick on the turn but his, his range is going to be wide as all heads up ranges are very wide three bings the back door flush draw uh, plan is to check call again Might have to call three, guys. Might have to call three. Uh, yeah, he's sizing up, so it'll be a pot-sized river jam if we do want to continue. Uh, there could be some merit in check jamming right here. Uh, shout out to Extreme. Actually, I kind of like the check jam here. If he does have a draw and he's barreling, he has queen jack, diamond, spades, a lot of straight draws. He can call us with a draw and we're shoving for value and denying his equity. Or he can fold and not realize his equity. So I, it's a good stack to pot ratio. We're going in. Middle pair for hopefully value. If we're beat, we can always get there. All in. No snap. That's good. That's good. Now he's going to really regret betting that draw. Has he had enough? Is he willing to call it off? Just to end it? Or double me up? Hold! We run him right! Got him! Mid pair for value! Knew we turned that draw. Woo! Someone clip that. Kings! Oh, he's gonna be so mad. I might wanna act quickly here, just because he's so inf uh, infuriated. But we're just gonna act semi quickly. Time bank hits, min raise. Shove it. Just tilt, shove it. Tilt, shove it. Oh, okay. I'll take that. I'll take that. Uh, very draw heavy board and hits his range very hard, so we're actually going to size up. Hopefully we can induce a check raise to about 1.5 million, and that sets up a perfect rejam uh, with the Kings for value. 
Mm-hmm. The tides are turning. All it takes is two hands. Let's get some action. You can interpret this big bet as something like 9-10, a flush draw, 6-7. And there it is. Huge check raise. Highly doubt that's for value. So we're just going to get it in now. Um, I mean, if he has a gutter, I don't even think he's going to want to call this min-raise jam. We're all in for $5 million and the chip lead. Pocket Kings, let's do this. You can't believe it. What's happened? Hold! Heart! Got him! 10 million chips. We got the chip lead. He says, really? He can't believe it? Hook, line, and sinker. Patience pays off. King's heads up. It says, well, for God's sake. Oh, he's so, oh, he's tilted. He's so tilted. He's going to type in another bet. Yep. Well, we know he did that with queen seven suited. How deep are we here? 160. Six million. 40 blinds deep. Uh, don't want a three bet call. Don't want a jam. So we're just going to call. Very good hand. Pretty good flop. Pretty good flop. Uh, we're gonna check call this. We got the overs, we got the nut draw, and we got the flush draw. We're back to our flush draw, overs, and nut straight draw. Similar sizing, uh, about a third of a pot this time. As soon as the time make hits, we're gonna put in the call. Wow, nuclear, nuclear wrap in Omaha. Uh, my gut says to check Jam. If he wants to get thin value from his uh, 10x or 8x, we're gonna really put him to the test here with the chip lead. Straight draw, flush draw, everything. Can we do it? Three hands in a row. From underdog to huge favorite, hopefully he just folds, but we're going in guys. 10 million chips. Hopefully he folds, if he calls, we got tons of outs. All in, 10 million, fold. That's right, we slow played it on the flop, now we're punishing you. He can't believe it. Give me those chips, queen high, to end the tournament. Give us that victory. $6,300. Got him. Queen high. Ooh, ace 10. That's a premium. He has three bet light to four. I did put it in the cold four ball when we were like five handed. Button versus small blind versus big blind. And here it is. Uh, I actually wanted him to three bet so we can just get this in pre. Or or just you know pick up a million when he's getting out of line with random ace x or finding out where he's at with king queen or small pairs most likely have the best hand so we're going to shove in 10 million chips we're all in says he can't fold we're going in let's win ace 10 Ace 10 hold! 10! 10! 10! We got it! Boom! First place, $6,345. The December of Jeff continues. Max late regged it. 10 blinds. Pick some spots. Definitely gonna go over this hand history with my uh, coach who studied GTO, uh, a lot of Pio simulations, and uh, try to plug some leaks. I feel, feel like a million bucks, always feels great to win a tournament. So I wanna thank everybody for joining. Hit that follow, subscribe button, plenty more streams coming probably this Sunday.